what is the one meter I really don't care about? Well, I really don't care about this thing. So, just out of curiosity, it says it's got a 600 volt max rating, but what do I got to lose, right? Nothing. Let's give it a shot. Fly spotter initiated on three, two, one. Clamps down at 1600. All right, so I have no idea what the specs are on this beast, but I know supposedly it has really good high specs, blah, blah, blah. I don't know where it clamps down at. I know it's got some moths in there. Um, yeah, but you know what? Again, another meter I just don't care about, but it's accurate at reading voltage. This much I know. So, you know, let's take um, DC voltage, do a quick test here. Should be 30 volts. Oh, 20 volts, sorry. Yeah. Select my range. There we go, auto. 19.9 volts. 20 volts. If I take it up to 31 volts, 30.84. Negative because I had this thing hooked in backwards, but you get the point. It works. So let's range it over to um, four digits. There we go. Disconnect my power supply. We don't need that anymore. Throw the fly swatter in line. No attenuator. And Let's see. Oh, by the way. Fly swatter. Got it. Good. Okay. Oh, you know what? Let's back this up a bit. I'm going to get a full picture of this one. Still not far enough. Jeez. How far back do I have to go? So here's this meter. I know that for calibrator use, it was off. And there were some function problems, button problems. There was basically some a lot of flux on the board. I cleaned it up. I resoldered just about every part on it. It's good for reading voltage and what have you. It's not good for producing 24 volts because it won't produce 24 volts. And milliamp and millivolt range output doesn't seem to work correctly. Um, but where does it clamp down? What is its max range? I don't know. Safety glasses on, fly swatter test, three, two, one. Well, we had a winner. We no longer have a winner. It's coming back. I can't believe it. It came back. All right, real quick, let's see if I get a reading. 2,384. Okay. So 3, 2, 1. Hold. 2,000, 2.3, 2.4 kilovolts. There it was. 2.3, 2.329. So this is 2.329, 2.329 kilovolts. Let's discharge this thing. Okay, so I decided to tear them down. This one most definitely has better clamp down protection. That's why it cut off at 1650 volts or whatever it was. Actually, this one's still on. Where did it cut off at? 1610. 1610 volts it cut off at. One thing I noticed is the chipset it's running. It's running that guy there. Uh, I can't get the name off of it, honestly. There it is. So whatever that symbol is, the FS9922-DMM4, it doesn't seem to care. It's like, I'll read whatever you throw at me, as long as the rest of the circuits allow the voltage to get to me. And, uh, well, it, it proved itself that it, it doesn't care. And I say it doesn't care because, guess what chip this one's running? A newer version, a different version, but yet still... The same manufacturer, the FS9721 underscore something or other. Can't get the lighting right. 
underscore LP3. Well, let's see if this still measures voltage correctly. Let's give it some power on channel two. All right, channel two. What am I at? Uh, I don't know. Start for two volts. No, that doesn't look right. It's trying to tell me it's two volts. Ten volts. Yeah, I think the chip may have been blown there. I think we had a chip issue. Yeah, I'd say the chip is dead. Three amps. Yeah, the chip is a little over the place here. One amp. She's had it. She's done. She's dead. Uh, 100 milliamps at 5 volts. Doesn't know how to handle milliamps either. Let's see what this guy is doing. And how much damage was done to this guy. Oh, 5 volts, what do you know? 10 volts. Hey! 31 volts. Hey! 1 volt. Hey! Uh, 742 millivolts. I'll be darned. That shocks me. See what those on the current. 500 milliamps. 2.743 amp. 2.742 amp. 1 amp. I believe this guy survived. I am shocked. But it also clamped down like it should have. And it didn't allow to take all the voltage in at 1600 volts. It was like, whoop, nope, too high clamping down. This one, nope, had nothing to clamp down. It just, it just took it. No fight, no argument, nothing. Shouldn't give in that easy. But nope, it did. And... It's little chip got burnt for it too. Oh well. I could care less now. In the trash it goes. Thanks for watching. Keep on tinkering.